Hi, uh, in this question it is given that uh, overall 36 rupees 90 paisa is made of 90 coins. So that are either 20 paisa coins or 50 paisa coins. So we need to find out how many 20 paisa coins were there. So this question can be solved directly by using equations, right? So first of all, let us say there are x 20 paisa coins and uh, their value will be given as uh, x into 20 and the remaining coins must be 90 minus x 90 minus x and their value will be 50 paisa which should be equal to 3690 paisa here we need to convert everything into paisa because uh, 20 and 50 both are in paisas so let us simplify this equation which will give you 20x plus so 4500 minus 50x equal to 3690 now this will uh, send this 3690 this side so 3690 to 3700 is 10 3700 to 3 to 4000 is 300 so 310 310 plus 500 which will give you 810 which is equal to send this 30x to other side so minus 50x plus 20x will give you minus 30x goes to the other side will give become 30x therefore x equal to 81 by 3 0 and 0 gets cancelled out which will give you 27 so there must be total 27 20 paisa coins so this is the traditional way of solving this question but we can also solve this question by using allegation method so let us find the average value of the coin here so overall 36 90 paisa divided by total number of coins are 90 so 0 0 gets cancelled out this will go 41 times so the average value of the coin here is 41 paisa now we have set a number of coins which average value is 20 paisa and also we have some other coins whose average value is 50 paisa and uh, average value of the each and every coin is 41 paisa so subtract so 9 this is 21 take the ratio 3 goes 3 times 3 goes 7 times that means the 20 paisa coins and 50 paisa coins both must be in the ratio 3 to 7 so we need to find out how many 20 paisa coins were there so we need to find the first part so first part divided by sum of the parts which is equal to 10 multiplied by total number of coins 90 so 0 0 gets cancelled out which will give you 27 okay this question can also be solved by using a logical method uh, logical method like for example let us assume that all the 90 coins are 20 paisa coins if you assume that all the 90 coins are 20 paisa coins then the total amount will be only 8 1800 paisa but how much we are fell short so overall value of the coin coins will be 3690 but we are getting only 1800 here so 1890 coins we fell short but if you replace one of these coins with 50 paisa coin how much value will increase see if you assume that all the 90 coins are 20 we are getting 800 just replace only one coin one coin by 50 then what happens this value increases by 30 because this is a replacement already 20 will be there if you replace that coin by 50 30 will increase so like that total how much we need to make up here 1890 so 1890 divided by 30 will give you how many coins we need to replace so we need to replace total 63 coins right so 189 divided by 3 will give you 63 out of this 90 if you replace 63 coins by 50 paisa coins how many coins are left so 90 minus 63 will give you 27 this is the logical way of solving this question